How's it going, everyone? Um, sorry, I just watched Deadpool and Wolverine in the movie, movie theaters, recent movie that came out from the MCU. Uh, and I wanted to give my thoughts on it. Um, so, this will include spoilers. I'll try to not talk about spoilers as much as I can, but I can't promise that I won't talk about it at all. So, if you haven't seen the movie yet and you're interested, then you probably shouldn't watch the video. I'll click away. Um, but that being said, wh what I would rate the movie and what my thoughts are is this, right? So, I, for me, it was like a 6.5 out of 10. Uh, so, I liked it. I didn't love it. I don't regret spending money or anything on it. But it, the movie was far from perfect, in my opinion. And I would say it's that it's the weakest out of the three out of the Deadpool trilogy, um, out of the first two Deadpools. Uh, the reason I say that is because the the heart of this movie is sort of the emotional redemption arc of Wolverine, his the character of Wolverine that Hugh Jackman plays, and also um, Deadpool's character kind of wanting a higher purpose. And I didn't feel like they necessarily executed that as well as they could have. And they earned those arcs um, as well as it, as it could have happened. And in a lot of the, I feel like, so in, in, and I felt like, so in actuality, what I'm trying to say is the story elements, um, the arc, um, kind of the journey the characters go through, I thought the plot, that the writing kind of plays into it too as well. That was not as fleshed out as it could have been. And, you know, usually with Deadpool movies, the humor adds a lot to the movie. It In the first two Deadpool movies, I felt like you could almost describe it as like seasoning to the movie, really. whereas they enhanced the movie, they made the movie more fun for the audience. Deadpool's fourth wall breaking and, you know referential humor kind of thing it really adds to the movie with this movie because it's more of like a redemption arc for these kind of sad characters especially wolverine and deadpool also um i feel like the humor actually kind of clashes with the emotional core of the movie if not clashes if clash is too harsh of a word then you could say it's kind of it doesn't enhance the movie or kind of is just parallel to the movie it doesn't necessarily you know, it, 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 like bring it together or anything. There's no sync. There's no like, um, you know, synchrony or kind of uh, teamwork, uh, so to speak. The, the, the flavors don't complement each other, I feel like, because the movie is at its core kind of like a sad redemption story kind of movie with Wolverine's character and Deadpool character too. And I haven't seen Deadpool 2 or Deadpool 1 in a very long time but this like in the movie essentially so this is kind of going to spoilers he he basically wants to be an avenger he wants to be part of a group and he wants to have like a higher purpose and that kind of thing and that felt a little weird also because i don't know if i could be wrong about this i don't know if that's um, consistent with his character in the first two movies. I don't know if the Deadpool in the first two movies would have cared about being on the Avengers, would have cared about higher purpose in life. I don't... He, he seems to care about specific people, right? Like his friends and stuff, which is included in this movie. It is continued. But I don't know if he necessarily cared about... would have cared about this kind of stuff. So I don't know if that pers perfectly aligns with this character. Maybe it does. And I could be wrong, because I haven't seen the movies um, in a long time. But... That felt a little off to me. Like, why does he care so much about, you know, this kind of stuff? I don't know. That I thought, like, that wasn't perfect. Um, but that's my mileage, right? Your mileage may vary. Um, I also felt like, again, the, the jokes and stuff were funny. But they weren't, like, belly, belly laugh-inducing funny. Like, they weren't... They're not, like, jokes that are, that are like, gonna throw you to the... Uh, on the floor, like, R-O-F-L, rolling on the floor laughing kind of jokes. They're more so jokes that kind of make you chuckle, or, like, they're, like, joke, like, they're, like, references to other things. 
like they reference like the 20th 20th century fox and things like that so they're like rent there's like kind of references and witty humor like it's more so things that make you chuckle and make you think like oh that was clever that was witty more so than like things that will like kill you than like just you know go into laughing and you're vibrating can't breathe kind of laughter it's it, for me so at least for me it didn't hit me like the, the humor didn't hit me like the first two deadpool movies hit me so i felt like the humor wasn't as good as the first two deadpool movies as comparison and the story again i felt like the story you know you hear a lot of cr movie critics talk about um deserving or like uh kind of executing and um movies um you know feeling deserved and that kind of thing i feel like again it it you know i wasn't bored but i wasn't i didn't feel like you know these it was completely like i wasn't like super emotionally invested with like wolverine's story at all if that the that kind of thing wolverine's arc and deadpool's arc really takes like a back seat to the humor and kind of it also kind of like the cameos as well too i think you know and the like in the over the topness of it right i think that actually takes away from the emotional beats of the movie and so for all these reasons i i i was never bored there were some movies where i feel like it was they're boring because they miss on a lot of things i was i wasn't bored with this movie i was entertained but i also didn't love it i wasn't uh like super encapsulated by it like a like a great movie to me will make you like will like pull you into its world and kind of make you forget about everything else and you're just completely immersed in this movie and this movie i i would say um didn't do that like super well but also wasn't like boring so that's kind of where my score of 6.5 out of 10 comes from, right? It was okay. It was average. And I would say the other, the first two Deadpool movies were above average. So I would say this is not as, not as good. Um, so that, those are my thoughts on the movie. Let me know your thoughts in the comments if you watched it, got this far. Let me know if you enjoyed the movie. What do you th think of the performances, the villains? Uh, what do you think of the cameos? Um, all that. And that's it for me. Thank you.